We will explain the observation procedure of the nanosuit method. Prepare a stereo microscope. Cut the filter paper into the appropriate size. This is a preparation for removing excess nanosuit solution. Prepare the sample stage, tweezers, pipetman, tips, kim wipes, etc. on the laboratory table. Place the thawed nanosuit solution in a place where it is easy to work. For living insects, put them in a vial and anesthetize on ice. Live samples should be transferred to the sample stage with as little damage as possible. Place the sample near the center of the sample stage. Apply a tiny drop of nanosuit solution to the sample. Here, we applied a drop of nanosuit solution next to the sample and moved the sample into the solution using tweezers. Use the filter paper to absorb excess nanosuit solution. It is important to firmly absorb the nanosuit solution with filter paper. Then, either hold the sample with conductive double-sided tape or place the sample on the double-sided tape to fix it. In this video, the sample was held with a conductive double-sided tape. Fix it on the sample stage of the electron microscope and put it in the scanning electron microscope. Immediately after the evacuation, the electron beam should be irradiated. Observation will start immediately after the evacuation is complete. Let's start the observation with nanosuit. Let's look at the head of a German cockroach. When you focus on the compound eyes, you can see that each eye has a characteristic surface structure. German cockroach leg structure. By using the nanosuit method, it is possible to quickly observe the ultra-fine structure that reflects the living state. The nanosuit method can be used in various situations. Sufficient removal of excess nanosuit solution is the key to successful observation. Nanosuit solution is commercially available from Nishin EM in Japan. For more information, please see the home page at http colon slash slash nissahin-em.co.jp slash english slash index dot html.